Good afternoon, Vikes. I'm Ava. I'm Olivia, and you're watching SVTV. Our school is participating in a school sock drive through the end of the year. Donations will go to the Silverbacks. A box is placed in the front breezeway for donations. Sophomores and juniors, if you think you would like to participate in the annual week-long trip to Washington, D.C. in November, please drop by Mr. Crumb's room. There will be a meeting tomorrow during CLP. The Fishing Club is reimbursing students that have purchased a fishing license this year. Bring your fishing license to Mr. Wilson and he will give you a check. This is the last week to sign up for driver's education this summer. May 6th is the last day. There will be a meeting during CLP in the auditorium on Wednesday. Interested high school students can study Russian for free at KU during next year's school year. There's an informational webinar tomorrow from 6 to 8 p.m. The theater department has been working hard on some new projects and wants to share some of their experiences. Let's check it out. I've been in theater since the beginning of my seventh grade year. I did some one acts and that was really what got me involved in it. This will be my second year teaching theater, but fifth year teaching in general. Right now I'm serving as an advisor for the International Thespian Society, which is really just kind of what helps run the theater department. And uh, I kind of help with some of the upper classes like players and, and advanced acting. Somebody should join theater to, number one, just try something new, get out of your comfort zone. It's really fun because you can act like somebody else. And if you're that shy person who doesn't want to be on stage, we also have a place for you and you can build stuff um, like our sets and be creative in that way. Uh, right now we're working on the one acts, which are student directed. So myself and Mary Page Bramlett are directing the one acts and that's this Friday, Saturday, so that's what we're working on right now. Um, if you're interested in all in joining theater or being a part of a class, you can come talk to me at any point and just try us out. And if you don't like it, then that's okay. But if you at least try, then it should be great. And then come, uh, come see the one acts. We've been doing pretty hard work to get that ready for you. Joining theater, contact Mr. Soffer. Senior waiver turn-in will happen on Wednesday during lunch. Anyone attending Washburn Tech, turn theirs in before they leave. Tomorrow, Kaylor Hazenkamp will sign with Highland Community College on an eSports gaming scholarship. Congratulations, Kaylor. Renee Sturgeon was awarded the 2021 Young Artist Award for Creative Writing. Congratulations, Renee. This Tuesday at 7 p.m., the choir, choir program is hosting their first concert in over a year. Your attendance is highly encouraged. A huge congratulations to the Lady Vikes track team with 18 personal bests at the meet last Friday. Now over to Ethan with the weather after this short commercial break. Are you interested in learning Russian next year? For free? Or maybe even earning three college credits per semester? Join the upcoming KU Slavic webinar on May 4th and see what this class can do for you. Students are even eligible for an introductory lesson on May 11th. Sign up on Schoology now. Okay, so today's weather forecast is we're going to be 60s most of today with a ton of clouds. Uh, this week is going to be mostly cloudy, and so is next week. It might brighten up just a little bit. And today is also National Different Colored Shoes Day. Hope you have your different colored shoes on. Uh, today at 1 o'clock, it'll be probably about 66. 3 o'clock is going to be about 68. And 5 o'clock is going to be about 66 again. Uh, the weekly forecast is going to be mostly in the 60s. Eight, it's going to go up to 80 on Saturday, and then it's going to go back down to the 70s for next week. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, now back to your anchors. 
That's all for today, Vikes. Have a great day.